So we needed to bend some thin wall aluminum tubing, this 7 8 inch. Um, problem is our little mandrel bender came with these large radius mandrels. And we needed a, a tighter bend radius. Um, these aren't read, readily available in smaller sizes, at least not that we could find. So we were wondering if we could just 3D print one, whether it would hold up or whether it would crack. First, we're going to try the aluminum. If that doesn't crack, then we're going to try some mild steel. That's what she said. Oh. And no. Okay. All right. It's a negative. <laughs> wow, you can... Oh, this is like stuck in there. For take number two. We took this part on our first attempt and made it solid. And I also extended the contact area. So hopefully it'll transfer the load. Better? Uh, same layer height, same infill as before. Let's see if this one cracks. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Almost had it. Ah. We're getting there. Oh, wow. Where'd the other piece even go? It launched behind the table. Okay. So, almost there. This is the old one, but this is the part that broke off along with some of the top. Oh, it was starting to bend this time. Yeah, it actually bent. It's starting to. Look at that. It's not a very good bend. Yeah, aluminum tube kind of crushes down, but... V1, broken. V2, wrecked. V3, much heft. So for V3, um, for V3, I increased the top and bottom by half inch, and went all the way around. I added some chamfer here to support it, and this was about 15 hours to print, over 500 grams of uh, filament. So hopefully it works. We've gone through about 1,500 uh, grams of filament so far. How many print hours total? We've printed for about 40 hours. Is that got a different density or anything? Any fill? Nope. Okay. So this is still five walls, 0.3 millimeter layers, and 50% infill. Now, when we increased the top distance on this part, um, it made our bender handle too large, so we, we milled to clear. Simple. All right. So do you think we should do it again, Kevin? It's a lot of a lot of printing. A lot of fun I mean, there. we can see where the weak area is. Yeah. It's so obvious. Yeah. I mean, we really should redo this. So why don't for now we just send it, we'll upload it. You reprint it. If it doesn't fail, we'll put it up for you guys. Yeah. But for now, I think we're going to call this a failure. Our, our last one actually bent better. Yeah. Our... 
You can see the last <laughs> one. Both failed in the same area. Actually, I should have seen that. We yeah, really need, you know, we need to take this out and up. All right. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Please like and subscribe below. And let us know what you think in We're the comments noobs. below. We're noobs. No, don't say that. Okay, go ahead. Don't say that. We're not noobs. <laughs>